118118. I've got your number. I bet they didn't expect anyone to figure that, this out. This Tower Bridge, January the 18th, 18. Psychological operation by the Zionist Freemasons, the next hoax in London, being predicted by myself. Now, let's have a little look. Right, you've got a London reference right the way through, the London Tube reference. Um, this one's called Urban Tube 118118. January the 18th, 2018, 0118118. Or 2018, which is 1118. So it's 118118, 1118, or just, or simply read straight, it's 11818. It's the only date that does that. Okay, now let's have a look. Um, hmm. Okay, this is part of that Alfresco Urban Tube advert for 118118. So, Battlefront Modding sent me this one. Every so often, you, you have you find something or somebody sends you something that really ties the room together and this one really does now you've got to think about foreground and background here I reckon you've got both operations here the first one in the foreground is the 118118 that's the Tower Bridge January the 18th that's Thursday in what, three days time Explosion, boom, to be blamed on, no doubt, the non-existent ISIS by the Zionists, of course. The Israel making Muslim people look bad with their media, their Hegelian dialectic operations with their secret services. Mossad, the Israeli Secret Intelligence Service, ISIS, their motto, by deception shall we make war psychological war by deception by lies it's just the very look of this guy in this is just telling you there's something going on something insidious and guess what the latest insidious film stars and all of insidious films star this jewish woman here lynn shay as elise rainier spelt exactly the right way. There it is, Mount Rainier. There it is, Mount Rainier, Seattle and Mount Rainier. Oh, it's just a coincidence, right? Yeah, that she plays Elise Rainier. Hmm, <laughs> no coincidence. Let's get back to it. Right, here we go. So, you got the Tower Bridge, January the 18th, 2018. Operation in the foreground. You've even got the date for it, blatantly mocking you. They figured that no one would figure this out. No one. And in the background, you've got the Seattle false flag on 322. Two. Of course, Seattle, the Emerald City, evergreen. Seattle, Emerald Green, 322, March the 22nd. Is it March the 22nd, 2018? Is it? 322, 18? It certainly, certainly looks like it, especially from that Ferris um, scene. Yeah, with 22 behind his head and 32 cap, 32 Shea Louise left and right of him. I'm saying 322, probably 32218, unless we have to wait another year. 32219. I doubt it though, because they've they've already done the 322, you know, Brussels 322, Westminster hoax 322. I reckon it, this they'll finish it off with 32218 Seattle. Okay, so about, there you go. Foreground, January the 18th, Thursday. Tower Bridge hoax by your 
Freemason government who are a bunch of Order of Solomon Zionists representing Israel as every country does, unfortunately. Israel's got everyone in their pocket through their Zionist mafia called Freemasonry. And then the big one. Now, there's a bit more. Not here. Maybe you can find something more here. I don't think you need anything more here. It's all there. It's all there. There it is. But, you know, the one thing that tells me more than anything else that Seattle, West Coast, Pacific Rim, false flag, will happen. It's this film and this film. It's this overlooked film, Escape from L.A., 1996. That's the one. That's the West Coast false flag. That's Seattle. If they move it down to L.A., San Fran, I don't care. It's still West Coast, Pacific Rim. But here we are. I'll do it again. Right? A near future police state America, walled Manhattan, Snake, one-eyed, Freemason, Pliskin. Freemasons call themselves snakes. They know what they are. He flies in on, a, on an aircraft, a glider, and lands on one of these towers. Come on now. An airplane going into towers. And look at this. Even, even this is more aircraft shooting through the towers. Okay. And that's 9-11. Blatantly 9-11. And this is blatantly the West Coast, Pacific Rim, Seattle, false flag. He This time he goes in on a submarine. There's no coincidence there. I mean, independently of all this, what did I conclude? Simple thing, that, it's, that the Seattle false flag is the final part of 9-11... And that is, it is a submarine missile boom on the west coast of America, most likely Seattle, followed by blackouts. And what happens in this movie, independently of my conclusion? Exactly that. He goes in on a submarine. He surfs the Her Hershey Highway, literally surfs the highway, and meets Hershey, the transgender Hershey. Paid by the, uh, the woman, Pam Greer. But it doesn't matter. She was playing a transgender character. Surfing the Hershey Highway. That's obviously gay Freemasonry inside joke. One-eyed trouser snake. Get it? One-eyed trouser snake. Surfing the Hershey Highway. I think you... Look it up if you don't know what surfing the Hershey Highway means. Eh? And look at this. One of the original uh, billboard posters that you would have had in the cinema. This is. You can see the clips on it. Uh, plan your escape. Now we have the same thing. Black out, get out. And what happens at the end of the movie? Mr. One-Eyed Trouser Snake Freemason types in the code and blacks out the world. Blackout. Sending everyone back to medieval times, as in The Cable Guy, with Jim Carrey and Ferris himself. Yeah, you pull the cable, you black out, and everyone goes back to medieval times, because there's no power. And of course, that's just your friendly local Zionist government turning out the lights in the power stations, and then blaming it on some external threat that doesn't exist, like Kim Jong-un from... Uh, North Korea, who doesn't mean anything bad to anybody, but hey, you believe the media, right? You believe the Zionist media, you believe any bollocks they come out with. So anyway, that's what you're going to get. And then, off we go, eh? After that, we have lockdown, martial law, madness, God knows what they've planned afterwards, but... Uh, It's telling you, L.A., escape L.A., escape America, plan your escape, L.A., your escape, get out, lights out, like the other movie. They give you enough hints, 
if you're clever enough, or if you can find my channel. Ready to eat. <laughs> oh yeah. 